Welcome to lesson three on punctuation, commas and apostrophes. Have a think, what types of punctuation do you already know? Full stops, comma, exclamation mark, question mark, speech marks, apostrophe, colon, semicolon, Ellipsis, dash or hyphen, brackets, and capital letters. Look at the ones that you know that you can already use correctly. Have a look at some others that you might have heard of before but don't really know what they're used for. Today we will look at commas and apostrophes. Comma. We use commas to separate parts of a sentence. The doorbell rang, startling Miss Mattock. Kobe, realising he was late, started running to school. All of a sudden, the cat jumped through the cat flap. Yes, that is right. They are also used to separate items in a list. Sean went shopping and bought carrots, cauliflower, tomatoes, onions and other food for his family. Now it is time to pause this video and go to the Google Doc sentence activity. Can you finish these sentences using commas to separate parts of your sentence? Here is another activity. Can you use commas to separate the items in these lists? Apostrophe. An apostrophe is used to show where a letter or more than one letter has been missed out. Do not is don't. I am, I'm, we will, will, cannot, can't, are not, aren't, they have, they've. Apostrophes are also used to show when something belongs to somebody. Harry's game, the doctor's surgery, the winner's trophy. In the first picture there is a boy reading by himself. This book belongs to one boy, so we add the apostrophe at the end of the word boy and then the S to show that one boy owns the book. In the other picture, there are two boys reading. These books belong to two boys. The apostrophe goes after the S at the end, so you can see the boys' books. Boys has apostrophe after the S, and that shows that there is more than one person that owns those books. Now pause this video and go back to your Google Doc sentence activity. Can you match the people with the things that they might own and write a sentence about them with an apostrophe in the correct place? The people are children, doctor, policeman, teachers, builders, actors, astronaut, musicians. The things they might own, messy desk, hammers, guitars, spacesuit, scripts, toys, surgery, tray and handcuffs. After you've done that one, can you think of any more words that use an apostrophe to show where a letter, or more than one letter, has been missed out? Kapa, you have now completed the workshop. It is expected that you work on commas and apostrophes in your writing tasks.